Today's adventure is 24 hours in New York City. What can we get up to? Good morning. Good morning. I think you slept well. I did not I did. sleep well. I'm a light sleeper. Uh, and the place that we're staying is more of like a hostel. Uh, just pretty loud. Not just people being loud, but like doors and just an older building. Um, so I'm feeling it. So first things first today, coffee, coffee uh, and then breakfast. potato bareca which is like a thick flaky crust with potato inside like poppy seeds uh, I'll be honest I had one of these yesterday and loved it so I came back today I'm no pro on New York City foods but this place is amazing I'm just telling you that's why we're back a quick breakfast coffee on the run now we got to catch the one train uh, all, the, all way the way down, down to the ferry building at the end of Manhattan Battery Park then we going to the Statue of Liberty in Ellis Island. I'm looking forward to spending some time on the ferry and getting some great views of NYC. Officially on Liberty Island, the Statue of Liberty is over there, which we saw coming in. We'll go over and check it out here in a little bit, but there's a bunch of other things. There's the Statue of Liberty Museum over here, uh, a beautiful view of downtown Manhattan area. So we are going to take our time probably for the next hour or so. Just absolutely gorgeous. How was the boat ride over here? It was good. Good. <laughs> also, in keeping in theme with national parks, Liberty Island is a national park, so it's another one we can tick off. Um, really excited to check things out. in the museum and then just taking in all the sights and sounds I can't help but feel just like an overwhelming just appreciation always grateful for our country but just the reminders we take so much for granted right team That's right. we do and so it's just super cool to see uh, in the museum just the things that it was structures being built but also just the amount of people over the years coming into this harbor looking for liberty and freedoms uh, to a new life and so 
It's just really, really good. We finally made it to the we front part. Oh man, it's like seeing the Eiffel Tower for the first time. Mm -hmm. Really, really awesome. We would love to spend hours out here, which there's no doubt in my mind you could enjoy hours out here, but because we're on a time crunch, we're gonna head over to Ellis Island now. Ellis Island has been a, a spot that I've wanted to check out for quite a few years now. So I'm excited to be here today. Spend an hour or so over here, then we have to head back. We have to pass this test. Let's see. All applicants must I'm nervous. Our president. One, 18, two, six. Next question. Which Read the, the whole question before you answer. Sorry. <laughs> I messed up the first one. <laughs> well, we have passed the citizenship test, so I guess we can stay. Say you're probably going to want to spend more time there than over the Statue of Liberty. Yeah. Uh, just because the Statue of Liberty, you walk around, which is amazing, but the museum part is much smaller. But here, there's yeah. so much history. We had to rush through, but you could spend you could spend hours in there. Yeah. Really, really impressed. So we're back in Manhattan. The whole experience took us about four hours. Mm -hmm. That's getting on ferry, off ferries, um, the trips in between, and then also the experiences that we were there. We're back in Manhattan. Uh, we're gonna head over to the 9-11 Memorial and out of respect for those who have lost loved ones um, and just the whole situation. We're just gonna show footage, not talk over that, so.
what uh, an amazing tribute to those who lost their lives. Emotional. Yeah, very emotional. Um, I think, yeah, without a doubt, even though you may not be a New Yorker uh, and you were born or in that age group of knowing, you remember exactly where you were um, when you heard about the horrific uh, terror attacks and so on. Um, just a beautiful uh, memorial.